In this overview, we will review some enhancements that have been made to the Data Visualizer app. We will discuss some quality of life improvements made to chart titles, including the gauge chart type, as well as when using relative periods, organization unit groups, and organization unit levels. We will also show you a new chart type, the single value chart. First, let's have a look at the gauge chart. In previous versions of DHIS2, when I created a gauge chart, the data item that I have selected will appear underneath the chart. If the data item that I selected has a long name, this name is cut off, making it difficult to understand what data is being represented on the chart. You can also review the periods of this chart. The last 12 months was selected, and you can see these months are listed on the title of the chart. In DHIS 233, I can review the same gauge chart as we reviewed using a previous version of DHIS2. First, we can see that the data item name has been moved from under the chart to the chart title. This will ensure that a data item, regardless of its length, will be able to be viewed in its entirety. Secondly, if we look at the periods, the title now shows the last 12 months, rather than listing all the months that have been selected. This change applies to any chart where relative periods have been selected and are being used as the filter. For example, if I have a bar chart from DHIS 233 and compare it with a bar chart from a previous version of DHIS 2, we can see the relative period is displayed in the title rather than the individual periods that comprise the relative period that has been selected. Note that this change only applies to relative periods. If I select fixed periods, as is used in this example, they will all be displayed individually within the title. Using our bar chart example, we can also show the changes that have been made when using organization unit groups or levels as the filter within a chart. This is an example of a chart in previous versions of DHIS2 where an organization unit group has been selected and placed in the filter. All of the organization units belonging to that group are placed in the title. We can see how this can be disadvantageous, particularly for organization unit groups with a large number of organization units. In DHIS 233, this has been changed to show the name of the group in the chart title, rather than all of the organization units associated with the group that you have selected. We can see how this cleans up the look of the chart when we compare it to the previous versions of DHIS2. This change also applies when using organization unit levels, as it will display the name of the level rather than listing all of the organization units belonging to the level that you have selected. The last improvement we will discuss is the single value chart. This chart type is shown here and displays a single value based on the data item that you have selected. It is very easy to create this chart type. Start by selecting the single value chart from the chart selector. Note that when you select this chart, the organization unit and period selections are moved to the filter, as you will only be displaying a single value that must be aggregated depending on the organization unit and period filters that you select. As an example, let us select a data item and use the default organization unit and period selections. Click on Update and the chart will show you the value. These chart types can be saved and placed on the dashboard just like every other chart. They can also be resized on the dashboard in order to be displayed at the size required. Some small improvements to chart titles in order to make them cleaner and easier to read, along with the new single value chart type, should be useful in a number of scenarios. We hope this gives you some more options to display your data to those that need to review it the most. We look forward to hearing your feedback on these features. For any questions or comments, please do not hesitate to contact us on the Community of Practice.